Hello everyone, this is Justin Smythe from nextbigtrade.com. This is your weekly review of the best stage two breakouts for the week ending December 1st, 2023. Starting off with PATH, an artificial intelligence stock that erupted on massive volume this week. This stock broke out of a stage one base on the weekly time frame, And this was the biggest weekly volume in the entire history of this stock. Uh, this stock had a couple of failed stage two breakouts earlier in the year on massive volume, but this stock, this breakout finally broke through resistance and now the stock is dynamically moving into stage two. Dropping down to the daily chart for PATH, after a powerful stage two breakout, the best time to really look for entries in a stock like this is to look for pullbacks down to the gap breakout area that sets up good risk reward because stocks that break out on massive volume you know with breakaway type volume tend to respect the gap uh, before moving higher so that is really the best place to look for entries on a daily basis and sometimes you know these pullbacks can take a couple of weeks to kind of digest a move like this before moving higher Turning to another high volume artificial intelligence breakout, ESTC essentially did something similar to PATH. You know, this stock had broken out earlier in August of this year, but really had no follow through during the stock market correction uh, that was going on from July until the end of October. And then it broke out this week after earnings on massive volume. Dropping down to the daily chart again, same type of thing with path you'd want to look for a pullback down to the gap breakout area and for the stock to respect the gap on the pullback because we have such massive volume occurring you know on the breakaway move here next iot is a stage two continuation breakout a former winner in the artificial intelligence space that erupted after earnings this week. Uh, you can see unlike PATH and ESTC, this one had a massive uptrend that ended around the June timeframe, went through a major correction, failed to break out during the stock market correction. Obviously the overall market was putting pressure on individual stocks and then finally followed through this week. Moving down to the daily, this one's a little bit less extended didn't have quite the power on the stage two breakout that PATH and ESTC did. So this one's potentially set up to really maybe have a smaller pullback, retest the gap area, and then that would provide a better setup uh, for entry before moving higher. Now the stock in this list, that's basically the best setup uh, as we start trading next week, uh, because of where really it's at technically is UPST. This one is coming out of a base on lower volume here, but you can see how it's kind of breaking out above the key moving averages and getting set up to move into stage two here. Dropping down to the daily, you can see that this one is just starting to break above resistance here and is not extended like path ESTC where you know a pullback is more likely so this one you know even a small pullback would be a good entry point because we're not extended really whatsoever here just starting an uptrend and look at how the volume's coming in here this is really massive accumulation and we've got a failed move lower here to potentially fast move higher so lots of good things going on here it does have some overhead resistance from back in august but it's in a powerful leading sector, which is artificial intelligence. Turning to a energy storage stock that broke out into stage two this week, FLNC. This is a kind of a continuation breakout to a stage two uptrend that really was not gaining much momentum. You can see how the volume here though is massive character change for the stock. Jumping down to the daily, you've got again, a gap up higher. You know, a good entry level would be a retest of the gap. And you do have some overhead resistance. Now, one problem here is there's really no sector strength here. 
that's a drawback for this stock, but it is showing strong technical characteristics. And we'll see if other stocks that are similar to this one uh, potentially form a sector move here. Finally, cryptocurrency stock IREN. This one broke out on extremely powerful volume this week. Stage two breakout above the key moving averages. And then if we jump down to the daily, we don't have a breakaway gap here, but we've got you know persistent buying. Basically, the stock is on its first thrust higher. You'd want to look for a pullback. You'd want to look for the volume to taper off on the pullback. And then that would provide a good buy point for this stock in the cryptocurrency space where the sector strength in this sector is gaining as well with multiple stage two breakouts over the last couple of weeks.